night rider, a shadowy flying into the dangerous world of a man who does not exist. Michael Knight, a young loner on the crusade to champion the cause of the innocent, the powerless, the helplessness, and a world of criminals who operate above the law. You can say what you wish, wish what you will, but I never eat a pig because a pig is a cop. I had the Terminator, like Arnold Schwarzenegger. Um, Michael, what are we going to do on this mission? Well, buddy, uh, I don't know what you mean. Devin mentioned something about busting a gambling ring or something. Nah, we were on vacation, pal. We got the uh, top up, the wind blowing in our hair. But Michael, uh, I could put my top down, you know. No, Kit, I'd rather not see that right now. Huh? What do you mean? Nothing. Um, so, <laughs> next time we go fishing, remind me to get you some wader boots. But Michael, I don't have feet. You're not making very much sense today, man. I'm sorry, Kit. Yeah, we'll just move straight on the... What the hell? Oh, that's Devin, Michael. Devin is calling. Well, pick up the phone, Kit. And um, we need you to get into the trailer ASSAAP. Do you understand, Michael? Well, yeah, Devin, um, can I ask you a question? Is that like, <laughs> you still have that goofy looking clown phone? I mean, the one that's like Fisher Price and has a smiley face on it. Goodbye. Oh, you really ought to grow up. Now, this is a very serious mission. Please do get here promptly. Goodbye. A clown phone indeed. Well, you heard him, pal. Let's roar the hell out of here. You got it, Michael. tracks are getting tougher and tougher to navigate. Bonnie! Bonnie! What's happening, sugar tit? Yeah, I mean... Huh? What were you getting ready to call me? Um... Nothing. I believe... I believe... Um... He was just getting ready to call you sugar. Uh, uh, diabetes. Yes, sugar diabetes is the number one cause of death now in Chicago. <laughs> Did you know that, Bonnie? Did you? Did you not be honest? 
No, but Devin is waiting for you in his office, and he's very furious. Oh, please, when does that old wrinkle sack not uh, furious? Furious. Did you get him that vacation that I asked you to, to play three rounds of golf with George W. Bush? Now, you know he just came back from vacation, Michael. Well, if he would have played three rounds of golf with George W. Bush, he wouldn't need the vacation from his vacation to vacation to vacation. Okay, Kit. That sounds good to me. Will you just get in his office? Why, certainly. No, 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 no. Yeah, I love this game, dude. Push the button, though. Oh, hell yeah. I'm gonna play shit out of this game. Oh, I'm not supposed to say those words. Oh, God, I'm gonna get eaten half to death. Can we get up there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, here we go. God, go that way, Pac-Man. Oh, yeah, you're blue now, mister. Yeah. God. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, touch them toes. Michael, what in the next generation of Star Trek, the next generation, are you doing? Um. Uh, yeah. Leading? Leading over here to your desk so I can sit down and listen to you tell me what it is you gotta tell me. Yes, you bloody well better be. This is a new computer. Ow! Oh, God! Michael, get a chair for crying out loud. What the hell's the matter with you? <laughs> Kevin. <laughs> Again with this stupid clown phone. Please promise me in the future, Devin, you'll get a new phone. And why aren't you wearing your glasses? Remember the last episode where you had glasses? Oh, and your hair is different. Oh, something about you seemed like you reverted back to the old Devin for some reason. I got LASIK surgery, Michael. So, my eyes are better. And, um, I dyed my hair. I made it look just a little bit darker. It's still gray. It's just a little bit darker. Okay. So, I'll go get a chair. I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, thank you, Michael. So, like I was saying, Denise Huxtable, well, she was the best one. Tootie, she was okay. I believe her name was Rudy, Michael. Tootie was from The Facts of Life. Oh, yeah. Okay, well then, wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I had a serious mission for you, Michael. Is this the part where I come in at? Oh, my God, there's two me's. Yes, we did have to replicate you and just in case you died and then we made another Michael Knight. Yeah, but I'm a lot smaller. No, actually, Michael, he's a robot. I mean, he's a guy... <laughs> Well, stick with your story. Yes, he's a robot that we built. It looks exactly like you, just in case an imposter came by and tried to steal your identity. Well, can I go to bed now? Yeah, yes, of course. Go to bed, you fool. Go unplug yourself with whatever it is you guys do to your things. Anyway, Michael, we believe that this man, John Jeffries, is committing fraud. He's making counterfeit bills as though they were real ones. And I need you and Kit to investigate. You must go to his casino. Casino, I should say. And wait a minute, Devin, I got something important to tell you. It's the most important thing ever. Oh yeah? What's that, Michael? <laughs> Michael! Well, I told you. It was important. Anyway. Enough of this tomfoolery. You leave this trailer and you go right to Kit. And, um... Oh, yeah. Where am I supposed to... Where am I supposed to go, by the way? Where are you supposed to go? 
Well, Cat knows where you're supposed to go. He'll he'll let you know. Oh yeah, the man's just a automatic GPS. He knows what the hell he's doing. Now, if you don't mind, Michael, you are dismissed. Uh, Bonnie will give you everything you need for this mission. <laughs> well, I'm glad to hear it. I'm getting the out of here now, if you'll excuse me. Okay, Michael. Thanks for talking to me. <laughs> no problem, Gary. <laughs> My name's not Gary, though. No, I know. Are you losing that, Michael? Maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> I'll see you later. Yeah. Hold on. This is stupid. What are you doing to your feet, Michael? This. Mm. With that stupid clown phone. I just did you a favor, Devin. Michael! Ugh. The company will never award me another phone. Gosh dang it. Well, Michael, you know your mission. Yep. I sure do, Bonnie. I sure do. Too bad I can't recruit Hulk Hogan for this mission. Why would you want to recruit Hulk Hogan? Oh, maybe he's just like, you know, we get special guest stars sometime, but not all the time. Be nice if Hulk Hogan came over here like he did on the A-Team. Will you just get going? RC, how you doing, my man? I almost beat Pac-Man, Michael. Well, that's good. Kit, let's get the hell out of here. You got it, Michael. Okay, cool. Well, I just saw a giant finger. Okay, bye. We'll bring you back a souvenir, Bonnie. Good night, Bonnie. Okay, Kit. Have him back in one piece. Will do. <laughs> I meant your um instruction booklet. <laughs> God, I'm funny. Well, Kit, where are we headed anyway? Well, Michael, there's a little casino. Right here on 12th and Bourbon Street. Oh, really? 12th and Bourbon, eh? Well, that sounds good to me, pal. I'm not much of a gambler, but I'll bet you anything. If there's phony money involved, these guys will be caught. They will be caught. Especially with your abilities, pal. Do, 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 do. Okay, now you all know how this works. Sure, we put our money in the pot and we play the cards. Yeah, can we just start? All right, gentlemen, it's five card draw, the game, and a hundred better to enter, and Jack's better to open. Sounds good to me, sonny. Let's get started. Yeah, let's just get started with this whole thing already. All right, Kit. I'm approaching the uh, the poker table now. They got some interesting uh, background pictures here, by the way, of Kansas, if you're interested. I can see everything that's going on, Michael. Just remember to keep your watch on. You got it, pal. Just remember to keep recording this. So, uh, <clears throat> is it too late to slam my money down on the table, or has the fun already begun? Sorry, sir, but the fun has already begun. You may enter after the next hand, though. Why, thank you. All right, Kit, just stay patient. He said we may enter after the next hand. Okay, Michael. Good. All right. What do you guys do?
Well, uh, let's see here. Mm, boy. Um, I believe I'll open and I will take two cards. There's one. Gentlemen, please refrain from exposing your cards even if you're, you know, discarding them. Shut up. There's another one. Did you just tell me shut up? No. I said shuffle them. Oh. Okay. Here's a card. Two cards you want. Yes. One. And. Oh, sorry. They're sticking together. <laughs> yeah, that's not funny. Two. There you go. How about you, sir? Who? Me? Yes, you. Did you say that jokers are wild? I didn't say anything was wild. Hmm. You know what? I think I'll take... Yeah. I fold. Huh. It's an automatic fold. How about you, sir? I think I'll take a kit. I think this hand's going to take a minute. I'm going to need to go to the bathroom. Okay, Michael. Well, you take your time in there now. Oh, I know what to do. Okay, buddy. Uh, you keep RC in here to keep an eye on him? RC is nowhere near Michael. Oh my gosh. Well, you keep an eye on them then. Here, I'll put my watch. Right. Excuse me. Oh, God, I'm sorry. Right there. Okay. All right. All right, gentlemen. What do you do? I believe I have a pair of threes and a king and an ace. How about you, sir? Huh? Who, <laughs> me? Why? Because it's your turn, I do say. Okay, let me see here. Uh, let's see. Um, I do believe uh, I will fold. Oh, okay then. Well, gentlemen, I'm sorry to say this, but look at this. Look at that. The dealer wins. Ah, oh, boo! <laughs> Don't worry. It isn't anything. It doesn't happen every day. Um, Michael, Michael, Michael. Are you in the bathroom, Michael? Do you hear that? Yeah, there's something over here talking. I don't know. God, that's weird. Now, I will allow everyone... Oh, God. <laughs> I barely washed my hands. Ugh. Let's just dry them on the table. Sir, please don't do that. Oh, sorry. Here's my money, Sonny. Now, deal me in. Well, that's not money. Oh, wait, yeah, no, that's po pocket lint. Hold on. Why is... All right, Sonny, here's my money. Now, get me in the game. You got it. Okay, next game, gentlemen, is five-card draw once again. And this time, the Jokers are wild. Oh, man, I wish you would have had that the last game. Well, I didn't. Okay, here we go. Okay, Kit, I'm going to have to win by any means necessary. You got it? I understand, Michael, but I don't like cheating. It's not cheating if it's for a good cause, pal. It's still cheating, Michael. Yeah, but we need this money. We need to prove if it's real money or phony baloney babylony money, if you know what I mean. You got it, Michael. Here it goes. Okay, cool. What what's that, sir? You got something to say? Oh no, just um go ahead and deal the cards. Alright, here it goes, fellas. Okay, gentlemen. Like I said, five cards stud. And Joker's a wild. There's one for you. 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 
Oh, am I skipping the old man? Here's one, two, three, four, five. There you go, old man. Okay, now let's continue dealing. Three. I believe that makes three. That makes three. And there is five. Now time for the dealer. Two. And that is three. And then four, five. Okay. Let's play, gentlemen. Okay, Michael. Let's see. The first fellow has a pair of sixes, it appears, and a pair of jacks. And the next fellow has, well, he doesn't have much of anything. No, he doesn't have anything yet. And the next fellow doesn't have anything either. And the old man has a king, queen, and an ace. All right, Kit. Thanks for the info, buddy. I have a pretty good hand myself. Looks like it's going to be a tight contest, but we need to win. I'll, uh... Oh, it's uh, your turn, Mr. Brown Jacket. Yes, sir. I'll take... Uh, let's see here. Hmm. What am I going to do? I'll take one. Yeah, I'll, I'll just take one card. Okay, one card it is. Oh, man, these are... And here you go. Thank you. Ah, that was no help. And I'll take two cards. Two cards? Yes, two cards. One. And two. There you go. Thank you. And you, sir. I'll, um... You know what? I'm just keeping these. Oh, geez. Looks like we got a real player on our hands, folks. <laughs> How about you, sir? I'll take, um, let's see here, uh, I'll take three cards. Ugh, thank you. And here's three cards to you. Let me get them off the top here. And here is, uh, one. Let's see here, two. And three. There you go. Thank you. And you, sir. Um, mm, let me check. Let's see here. Uh, I'll take two cards. All right, two cards to the old man. And that's one card. And uh, that's two cards. Hope that helps you out. Okay, gentlemen, start your bidding. Wait a minute. Huh? What do you mean? Oh, nothing. Okay, gentlemen, start your bidding. I'll bid... Uh, let's see here. I'll bid 20. Oh, yeah? Well, I'll see your 20. And I'll raise you 30. Ha! Huh, that's an old joke. I'll see your 30 and raise you 40. And I believe the bet's to you, men in green. I'll see your, what was it, 40? You measly 40. And I'll raise you 50. And I'll see you 50. And I'll raise you 65 more. And I'll see all your 65s and raise it to 100. Okay, the bet is now 100. Men in brown jacket, can you go? Uh, let's see my cards again. Dang, all these cards are all mixed up in here. You know what? I'll see your 100 and raise you two more. And I'll see your two and raise you two. Really? What do you got? I mean, never mind. Yeah, you better never mind. Anyway, yeah, I raised that. I'll call. Yeah, me too, I call. Yeah, I call too. I call. 
Oh, I fold. You fold? Yes, I do. Excuse me. <laughs> Whoops. I gotta go to the bathroom. But we're gonna take a bathroom break here in about 15 minutes. Oh, well. Okay, gentlemen, let's see your cards. All right, here's my cards, young man. Look. Look over here. One second. I got a pair of fives. Whoops. I got a pair of fives and uh, a pair of kings. I see the kings, but where are the fives you speak of, sir? I'll show you. Look at there. Oh, wait, no. There's an ace in there, but there's definitely a pair. So you have one pair, ace high, is that right? Yeah. How about you, sir? I, um, hmm. I also fold. Oh, that's crazy. How about you? Well, he called me out, so got to show you my hand, right? That is correct. All right, take this. Pair of jacks. Pair of sixes. Wait. Pair of sixes. And a nine. Does that mean anything? There was a pair of sixes, by the way. That was a nine. Yeah, but you, you still have a pair of sixes. All right, how about you? Oh, yeah, you folded. Well, I guess you're last, Mr. Black Jacket Man. All right, well, you're never going to believe this. Oh, I believe I will believe it right out of the chute. All right, check it out. I believe this is what they call full house. I'm not sure. Pair of aces. Let me see. Pull out the other one. There you go. A queen. A king. And jack. Whoops. A jack. Oh my god, you win! I do? Yes, you win everything! Oh my god, I can't believe it, I won! Okay, kid, so far so good. All right, gentlemen, the next game is seven card stud. Hey, wait a minute. I don't believe he won that. Shut up. Well, will you look at that, folks? Mr. Black Jacket wins again. I mean, just look at that hand. Boy, it don't it look lovely. A pair of kings, a pair of aces. Yeah, well, that does it for me, boys. Get up and collect my winnings. Yes, sir, re Bob. Collect my winnings. Hey, Bub, our boss wants to see you. Who, me? Yeah, don't be a wise guy. I don't want to see your boss. Oh, well, yeah, well, that's too bad. Oh, no, no, no. That's not too bad because I don't want to see your boss. Well, he wants to see you, so you come with me whether you like it or not. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Ooh. All right. Take them off, boys. Boys. Hey. What am I? In this together uh, by myself? Jeez. Come on, boys. He's getting kind of heavy. I don't like this too much. All right. Hey, what the heck's going on here? Huh? I didn't tell you to, to beat him up. Well, I had to knock him out. He wouldn't come see you. Yeah, well. Here, let me help you with him. Okay, this is kind of unorthodox. Unorthodox, morphodox. We gotta get this guy out of here into my office. Come on. Come on, we gotta do it right now. Come on. God, you sure are strong, boss. Well, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, I assure you there's nothing to see here. See, we just carry him right up to the van. Boy, you sure are smart, boss. Oh my god, I mean, oh my god, Michael. Don't worry, I'll tell this guy. Where are we taking them, boss? Out to the woods where we take the others. Where else? Oh, yeah. Okay, boss. Um.
I'm right behind you, Michael. Don't worry. So I can see between the lines. You quit singing, bub. You're making me angry. Oh, what are you going to do if you're angry? You don't want to know what I do when I'm angry. All right, I hear there's a lake right over here. Just toying right there. Got it. Don't worry, Michael. I'm tracking them and I will find you. What's all that noise? Don't worry about that. It's just the machinery around here. Now slide that door open. Ah, uh, the catch is stuck. Alright, wait a minute. Here it comes. Alright, let's throw. Alright, let's throw him in the river. You got it, boss. Yeah, you sound different. Shut up. I mean, boss, come on, he's heavy. Tell me to shut up. Next time I'll shove you in the river. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, wow. Ha <laughs> he's in the river. Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. Let's go. Poor Michael, you are knocked out. Oh, if I don't get you out of there, you will drown. I will send a shockwave to your system to wake you up. Hang in there, Michael. Thank you. You can start by drawing off before you get in the car, Michael. Oh, I don't know how to do that. Wait a minute, kid. Don't you have an automatic blow dryer of some kind? Oh, yes, Michael. Here, take this. Whoa! My God, that's amazing! What is all this noise, Kit? I think we're at some kind of sanitation plant or something, Michael. All right, Kit, let's blow this popsicle stand and go catch us some criminals. Sounds good to me, Michael. Hang on to your butt. I only got one. Do 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 do. I just thought it was something cool. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, what was that? The boss is gonna be really happy with us, bub. I am the boss, you idiot. Oh yeah. Hey, wait a minute. Look at those stupid black cars in our rear. Well, let's try to lose them, bub. Speed up a little bit. Kit, can you shoot a laser beam disruptor at these guys? Let's say, just target their tires. I don't want to kill them. You got it, Michael. Crap, we're driving 
down flat. Oh no, that ain't good. No, oh, hold on to your. Oh god, I can hear it tumbling. Hey, what are you doing? I'm gonna ram those suckers. No, don't do that. Luckily, I do believe they are attempting to ram us. Turbo boost time kit. You got up, Michael. Let's get the hell out of here. You got it. Kit, okay, let's turn it around. There you go. You read my mind. I will try to stay inside the car. Sorry, pal. We're not going to get very far on a busted tire, bub. Well, let's do this. Turn around and ram them suckers. Yuri, try that. Oh, yeah. Mm, well, let's do it again. Well, kid, I guess they're just not going to learn their lesson, pal. Okay, let's prepare ourselves for a collision. You got it. Hey, Michael. Yes, kid? Looks like they fought the law and the law won. Ah, oh, very funny. How are their vital signs, pal? Um, well, the driver's knocked out cold, but... Uh-oh, there goes the boss, Michael. You better grab him. I will. You... Oh, God, no. You ain't gonna... I mean, you ain't gonna stop me, you little son of a bitch. Ah! You'll never catch me. You'll never catch me. That's what you think. That's it. You asked for it, mister. Now I'm gonna kick your butt. You no good for nothing but. Now you take this. Huh? Oh, no you don't. Oh, God! Gotcha. Oh. Salvador Maroni, you're under arrest for counterfeit money making in the third degree, drug selling in the second degree, illegal gambling in the fourth degree, and cheating in the casino in the sixth degree. There is no such law as says anything about cheating in the casino. Well, I don't care. You're still going to jail for the other things that I just said. Hmm, they gotta convict me first. I think we got enough evidence to do that, don't we, Kat? We sure do, Michael. What the hell? That's right, pal. Oh, and should I add kidnapping and attempted murder to those charges? What are you talking about? Kit's got everything you dirty a you dirty butthose did on film. And we analyzed the money that I won at the casino. It's all fake. Just like you, Mr. Um, Salvador Maroni. Oh my god, what are you going to do to me? I'm picking you up. Ugh. Why did you do that for? So I can do this. hi yeah. Oh god, you picked me up just so you knocked me down? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Finally, justice has been served. Well, Kit. What do you say we go back to the Foundation? Actually, Michael, uh, Devin's wanting to meet you in the trailer. All right, then. Let's go to... Let's go to the trailer. Ugh. Like how I slid over the car, pal? Oh, yes, that was so Starsky and Hutch. <laughs> Are we just going to leave what's-his-name here, Michael? Who, Salvador Maroni? Um, yeah. Um, probably. Then how are the police supposed to pick him up? Well, for your information, Kit, here come the police right now. Oh. 
there they are. All right, let's get out of here. You got it, Michael. Sounds good to me. You're going to pay for this night, Foundation. Mark my words. to face a couple of silver spoons were one of a kind someday you might find Michael please quit singing that song sorry Kit what's up Bonnie uh, who's this guy huh oh hi Michael hi Kit this is Dr. Von Stusen Noodle he is um, my new assistant yeah hi Michael it's nice to meet you Wait a minute, is this the guy? We don't talk about that, Michael. Oh, okay then. Um, Devin wants to commend you on a really good job. Is Devin in? I really need to speak with him. Hello, Michael. What the hell? I am right here, and I'm very, very proud of you. You saved the day once again. Well, I couldn't have done it without... Oh, yes, of course, Kit. Ah, yes, Kit. Of course, you are, as always, a marvelous, marvelous creature of um, technology, as it were. Anyway, Michael, we would like to thank you once again for helping the Foundation. And um, I do believe this earns you and Kit some vacation time. Oh, boy, that sounds good, Michael. What are you going to do with your vacation? Who? Me? No, the one-armed man. Yes, you, you dang fool. Well, I'm going to make some balloon animals and then eat some crackers and, um... Oh, my dear, Michael, that sounds like a boring time. Well, you want to come... You want to come with me, Kit? Where are we going, Michael? Well, to the circus, of course. Oh, <laughs> even Kit doesn't want part of your shenanigans. Oh, boy. Hey, do you know where a guy can get some whiskey around here? Huh? Ugh, got my arms caught. No, I told you, brother. The bar is closed. Oh, God. <laughs> do 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 do! Ah, do 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 do! Um, Hogan? Yeah? Can you get your arm off of my butt? Oh, sorry. Do 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 do! One man can make a difference. Make a difference. Make a difference. Make a difference.